when you asked why El Paso, the answer is why not? Because El Paso is a vibrant, growing community. The mayor of El Paso today was excited to announce that an outdoor amphitheater will be built in the Northeast. The CEO of the company, Notes Live, shared why he chose El Paso to build his next $80 million investment. What brought us here is just the, the excitement around the city of El Paso. It has been in our top three since we started our business. So the big three things for us is when we're looking at a site is we, we start with the demographic. Um, does the demographic work for an amphitheater? Number two is, is there a public-private partnership that could exist there? Um, and if so, what does that look like? These, then the third piece is, does it fit the routes? Does it fit, does it fit um, routing off of other amphitheaters? The Sunset Amphitheater will be built at the city-owned Cohen site in Northeast El Paso. It has been in our top three since we started our business. The venue will seat close to 13,000 people. It will also have 120 fire pit suites, including a contract for them to host 40 concerts a year. On top of that, this venue will develop more hotels, restaurants, stores, and family entertainment around this area. We see a lot of companies coming there and growing and creating a lot of jobs. While all of that sounds great, I did ask the mayor and other local leaders how much this will cost the city. The city is not having a single dime from its general fund. This is rebates for what they're generating, so this is not costing the taxpayer one dime. They were talking about jobs they provide, but it's more than that. As people will start companies and people will start growing around that area, it really excitement breeds excitement. There has been some questions today about what will happen to the Cohen Water Park that is right next to this venue. However, I asked city leaders this question and they said that the Cohen Water Park will be staying where it's at. And the CEO of Notes Live is in the process of getting their building permits. Construction will be projected to start in August of 2025 and the venue will officially open in March of 2026. I'm reporting live in Northeast El Paso, Julia Spencer, KFOX 14 News at 5. Okay, Julia, thank you. So this project is not part of the multipurpose center that was approved in a 2012 bond vote here in El Paso. So the city's actually saying that that project is proposed to be built at the former train depot downtown. That one is still in the works. So according to the mayor, Oscar Leeser, the amphitheater has nothing to do with that multipurpose center and that the two will not be sharing any funds.